All right, we're going to cover a few uh, end of the design maintenance pieces here. So one of the things we want to do is let's go through a few of these extra features here. We have a hide and show warning icons if we're getting any of those showing up. Uh, we can select connected components and all of its downstream components. So we can come on over and we can select that and that shows us that specific zone. Um, we could come over and uh, do the same thing again with pretty much any zone. And we'll show it what we're connected to. So let's come on over here and uh, well, we'll get to this one in just a little bit. Let's go over here and I'll show you another piece here. There's also a recalculate button. If you're adding pieces, we can recalculate this. If it's not recalculating, it will automatically recalculate the entire function, which is great. AEC, again, let's head down. I wanna show you this one, select components with warnings. This is a key to really see how this works. Um, this is a double check feature that is wonderful. So we can select that and it's going to highlight everything with warnings. And uh, we'll ignore some of this right now just because of the video and what we're doing. But let's come up here. We've got a couple heads. This, this is bothersome. Why do we have a couple heads here? We can select them. Let me pull my OIP over here. And it's telling me right in here in red, not connected to network. And I'm guessing this is the same thing here. So we've put a pipe in here, but we're not connected to anything else. So let's come on over, let's grab a lateral pipe, and let's make that connection. And that works pretty good. It will automatically recalculate and go from there. Now one of the other pieces that would be really great is, let's go ahead, let's deselect this once, let's just get rid of that. And again, we can also double check if we need to. We can select connected components and come in and it, this will select anything downstream from that valve. So we can see what we're connected to and we can see right away we're not connected to either one of these. So we know also as another piece where we're at. So let's go ahead, let's just add that lateral line in there, make sure that we're connected properly. We're good, we've recalculated everything. So that's looking good to me. And if you really wanted to, you can see the entire network. Let me get rid of the OIP here. Let's zoom this back. And again, anything connected to that, we can come in here, select uh, connected components, and let's just go to our POC and we have everything. And now we start to see that anything after that, we are not connected here. There is something wrong here. So looks like right here, we are missing something. So again, another great check. Let's see what this is. And to me, it looks like we have, let's hide that jump there. Actually, it's not even connected to the pipe there. So that's a great little thing to know. And let's go ahead and connect that right to the network. And there we go. We have now connected that to the network. We are ready to go. We should be good. And we can double check this again to make sure we don't have anything that is not connected. And it looks at that point like we are all connected except for that one right there. So again, we can come over and correct that. So again, you can see how this is a really nice little feature. You get a lot of these heads, this happens. And it's kind of difficult to maintain that if we're not having some sort of check and balance here and we can do that very simple here, and now we're good to go.